So even with these CDPR content news droughts, I still find you daily info on Cyberpunk for your viewing pleasure. And if you guys do enjoy the video, I can't tell you how much hitting that like button really helps me and the channel out. Also, sub for those daily Cyberpunk videos. So what new info or news do I have for you today? Well, we have a couple of new interviews with CDPR devs. Won't lie though, with the info we have, not much new shits was spoke about. We have new adverts, new promos like these amazing Adidas limited edition trainers, new magazines as well as a very strange coincidence scene from footage from years ago which seemingly predicted the release day of Cyberpunk 2077, which people we will start this video off with. Now this was shown to me by my pal. My The Life Crisis, who also posts those daily cyberpunk videos, who if you want to check out, his channel can be found linked below. So do you guys remember the 48 minutes of gameplay, the walkthrough we got from about, was it about a year, two years ago, probably longer? Not sure now, but it was from some time ago. Well at the very start we see an instance of a female version of V being selected to play through this playthrough. Check out this image we see on the screen now. This image is literally a snippet from that video. Do you notice anything here guys? Look at her birth date. You guys see that? The 10th of December. Um, where else have I seen this? Well yes guys, it's the day of release of Cyberpunk 2077. Now I know some people abroad are thinking, well this date format reads the 12th of October. Well CDPR are based in Poland, and that's where this game is mainly being developed. Their date format is the same as 99% of Europe and it's the format that reads the 10th of December. So how weird is that people? Tell me down below in that comments section. Okay so this next one's kind of funny. I think even Google now have come to terms with not actually stating a proper release date for Cyberpunk 2077 as when you search release date for this game it just states 2020 which wasn't the case before. Okay so next up we have an amazing new partnership which is CDPR and Adidas where we see some amazing looking limited edition trainers and well in my opinion these are incredible but there's only one problem here guys they are coming to the Asian market only so chances of getting these elsewhere are slim unless you pay overpriced for them. Kind of sucks I know as I know many people outside of Asia would love these me included. Okay so moving on, and do we have any WWE fans in the building, or is it just me? Well during the latest Survivor Series show we saw that WWE and CDPR have joined forces to advertise and promote this game. To be honest I didn't expect to see this when watching the show but it is pretty cool. Okay so moving on, and next up we have a new magazine with exclusive interviews in. Problem is right now, the magazine is in Polish only and there ain't any English translations anywhere I can find. I went to purchase it digitally, but it seems as though you have to be a resident of Poland to purchase it, so that sucks. But hey, if any of you guys are from the beautiful country of Poland and are okay purchasing this, be sure to hit me up on my Discord link below and I will happily refund you the money for sure. Actually hit me up on Discord before you purchase it because I don't want to be hit by about 200 people telling me they've purchased the magazine and they want a refund. But the brief description from this new magazine, which is called Pixel, it states a city from the future interview the creators of Cyberpunk 2077. So it could behold some new information and it's why I want to get my grasps on it. Okay so to end the video guys we actually have a new interview in English which we can actually read through. Unfortunately I won't waste your time and state it's full of new information because it is not. In fact there's nothing new here I feel you don't already know. The interview is with Patrick Mills and Keanu Reeves and it's by Collider which by the way I'll link within the video description. There are a few remarks in regards to multiplayer but they just stay as of right now they are working on the main game first. But the interview and the article, to me, in my opinion, is just more so based on the influences behind the game, as well as them talking a little bit about the original tabletop version of Cyberpunk. Again, in my opinion, there's nothing new here, but if you do want to read through it all, you'll find it linked below. And that is it guys for another news video. As always, anything new drops, I'll have you covered right here on my channel. So subscribe if you're new around here and want more cyberpunk. Also hitting that like button really helps me out too. Now guys, before I put a stop to this video, if you haven't pre-ordered this game yet, 
I am giving away copies on every platform. To be with a chance of winning one, drop a like on this video, leave a comment down below and make sure you are subbed. The more of my cyberpunk videos I see you are supporting, the more of a chance you will have of winning and I will announce winners one week before this game is released and I'm hoping that is the first week in December. So good luck everybody who enters. On that note guys, the end of the video has arrived. I hope you enjoyed it and hopefully I will see you on that next one.